Uh, hello everyone so I hope you are not doing good so in this video I will explain you whenever jot form submitted we have to send a whatsapp message to the client okay uh, I am using a senda app for whatsapp okay and the tool I am using is uh, integrately so let me uh, so this is my jot form in which I submitted name submitted anything for test purpose any name test test so if I click this is my last button okay so I just submitted before uh, 8 minutes ago on so my data is came so first of all i will explain my uh, automation so i added a web hook in jot form and whenever form submitted and whenever form submitted it will i added a thank you page as well in jot form after that i added automation delay for 10 minutes uh, because this is my use case and after that i get a submission id from jot form the all the details what submitted we get by the way we get all the data in this step but the thing is that using this step we have little bit uh, good format all the variables i will show in history so after that i am using api call of sender app so sender app which api call i am using uh, this is the api call okay in that you can use uh, these are the parameter all four parameters value so instance id normally you get from access token you normally get from your account easily if you want but the thing is that uh, for uh, instance id you have to create instance okay with the help of token id then you have instance so before you call that api you have to create your instance id based on token just like a two way authentication you have to create token similarly in some uh, areas in which you can provide API key and secret then they generate token and after that you can use that token later step similarly in this you have to put your token and then it will create your instance in the account and after that you these two things you can use in our steps so this is how it done so let me show in a history if it runs uh, so if you can see I run on uh, let me right now uh, uh, the time on my side is 242 so uh, let's see I'm waiting in two minutes it will run let me explain to you the previous steps how it happens when I didn't add uh, a delay so just give me a second if uh, I have so I just check if I go back okay you can see it run uh, so at 232 it was stopped let me show you as well uh, so 246 because it ran on 240 uh, you can see 248 242 okay 242 p.m. so let me show the execution as well if you can see a perfectly fine delay in whenever I get it give me a received all the information properly in separate variable what we submitted there okay so with test 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 with number and after that uh, I try to send this using this webhook data and they receive a status code is 200 the SMS is sent if I show you the SMS uh, where you can see SMS I think it starts from my number but the thing is that this is how you can receive your SMS so let me show some HTTP uh, module as well if I able to show just give me a second go back so basically I implemented uh, in this data post data with URL and there, uh, below we added a data like explaining API so I hope you understand the process if you have any query do let me know in so similarly you can implement these all in other platform Pebbly Zapier and make as well 